Traffic at BC Ferries over the holiday weekend has been lighter than expected, but that isn't stopping drivers from speeding to and from the ferry terminals. A news reporter Stephen Andrew has been on the road for most of the afternoon. He joins us live now with more details on getting on and off the island. Stephen. Eric, uh, traffic is a little heavier now on most major routes, but for the most part, BC Ferries is reporting smooth sailing. As the Victoria Day Parade wraps up downtown, drivers arrive early at BC Ferries Swartz Bay Terminal, getting the jump on heavy traffic as the long weekend winds down. By early afternoon, reservations are only available for the last sailing, but customers are surprised to find no wait for ferries. We couldn't get make a reservation today, but we got here and there was no cars, so no, it's been good. So far, it's been okay. Yeah. We, we came over uh, yesterday morning, and it was all right, and so far, I'm surprised it's not too busy today. BC Ferries says the heaviest volume occurs around 3 p.m. as passengers rush to get home after their long weekend vacation. But the people who didn't take a day off from this holiday weekend are Saanich Police. They've been checking cars on the Pat Bay Highway doing speeds of anywhere to 20 to 35 over the speed limit. Speeds, uh, they're picking up. Everyone's trying to get home. It's the end of the long weekend. They've got some uh, RV cleaning to do and get ready to go back to work tomorrow. So we are seeing an increase in speeds today, but overall over the weekend they've been reduced. Despite stepped up enforcement, police are encouraged. The May long weekend is notorious for being one of the most deadly on the roads. This year, Sandwich police say they are not seeing near the number of crashes. We've seen a reduction in crashes. Uh, the speeds overall are, are reduced. Uh, that's typically different from the normal May long weekend where we uh, do have a lot of collisions on the highway, just given the high volume of traffic. And they hope it stays that way, pointing out slowing down will get you home a little later, but at least you'll make it. And police are also reminding drivers, Eric, that they can impound cars for excessive speeding. Current conditions, though, by the way, at BC Ferry Terminals, a possible one sailing wait on major routes to and from Swanson and Swartz Bay. Also expect busier than normal conditions tomorrow morning from 6 to 11 at Swartz Bay and 6.30 to 11 at Departure Bay in Nanaimo and 3 to 5 o'clock at Swanson, Eric, as people are taking just one extra day on this long weekend. All right, Stephen, thank you. Stephen Andrew reporting tonight. You're welcome.